the world's smoother, faster, safer operations at Tucson International are the goal of the new runway construction there. As KGUN 9's Craig Smith reports, Senator Mark Kelly toured the airport today to talk about what it takes to make that project happen. Tucson International Airport is like an economic funnel, but like an amplifier too. It gathers people and money into our region and then helps spread it around. And now there is federal money coming to make this place much safer. Tucson International is a busy airport, sometimes too busy, with large planes, small planes, and military jets from the Air National Guard. After smaller projects to make taxiways safer and prepare for more major construction, the Tucson Airport Authority is preparing to add a new runway to enhance capacity and improve safety. Senator Mark Kelly views the project not just as a senator, but as a former Navy pilot and shuttle astronaut. He says it's a real concern if you have trouble on a takeoff or landing and your runway's not much wider than a road. And we now have a path forward uh, to getting this runway uh, built and, and operating. Uh, and when we do that, you know, we, the expectation is uh, there will be more commercial traffic out of, um, out of Tucson International, uh, which is great for the community and taxpayers and the public. The airport's getting $44 million from the bipartisan infrastructure bill Kelly helped pass. TIA may get another $200 million when Congress votes to reauthorize the Federal Aviation Administration. Airport Authority CEO Danette Buley says money that lands at the airport lifts more than the airport itself. It ripples out into the regional economy. As we sit here today, the annual economic um, impact of the Tucson Airport Authority, uh, Tucson International Airport and Ryan Airfield is 8.3 billion each and every year. And from that, there are generated about 42,000 jobs. And so the airport is a real critical element in that, in that cycle of jobs and economic prosperity. Passengers coming through TIA may not think much about safety, but John Nilsson says a wider runway sounds good to him. I think that when you're coming in on a turbulent landing like there is here in Tucson, it's kind of nice to know that you will have a wider runway than a narrow one. So I, I think that, that I don't think I necessarily was thinking about it. I just hope it's there. A medium-sized jetliner can weigh 80 tons. It takes time to build a runway able to handle that for years on end. So the new runway at TIA will probably take about four years to complete. At Tucson International, Craig Smith, KGUN 9. I, I vote for wider runways yeah. just for the safety concerns. But I agree. It's not something you think about. No, you, you just don't. hope it's there. You don't, and it looks like it will be. All right.